Hi, this is Christy from Sensory Learning for Life. Story stones are a great way to help children learn the different elements of a story. In this activity, story stones in combination with a sensory tub convert story time into a sensory rich, play based experience for the children. I also hid the stones around the yard to add the challenge of a treasure hunt. To make the sensory tub, I used a bowl and some dry green split peas. We made the story stones using river rocks we collected at a nearby river. We used scissors to cut out the pictures and glue to stick them onto the rocks. The children helped with this part of the setup. The tactile sensation of raking their fingers through the dry peas was very soothing for the children. I used a number of sensory elements to make this a rich sensory play experience, thereby increasing the likelihood of information retention. I made the story stone activity into a treasure hunt with the story stones hidden around the backyard. There are many benefits for doing this. It engages the active learners who need a lot of vestibular and proprioceptive sensory input to learn. It gets kids out in nature because we know that exercise and fresh air are important for keeping their minds active. This activity had the children using their cognitive skills, problem solving and reasoning skills. They also identified the characters of the story as they found them. The children retold the story as they found each of the stones around the yard. This helped them consolidate their learning and promoted language skills. The children used vi visual processing skills, discerning an object amongst its surroundings, and the tactile sensations of playing with different textured playthings from nature, rocks and the split peas, provided a rich sensory play experience. The combination of story stones, a treasure hunt and a sensory tub made for a great sensory rich play based learning activity. I used this activity for a Christmas story but you could adapt it for any other story too.